Let's have a look at some of the new features available in Financial 17. New features in this version include improvements to do-it-yourself tables, changes to schedules behavior, and updates to balances in the cash flow worksheet and cash flow statement. In the financial statements document, you can now easily copy and paste an existing do-it-yourself table within the notes section. Let's copy the following do-it-yourself table. Expand its contents by going into edit mode. Then right-click and select copy do-it-yourself table. You can then paste its contents within the notes section by right-clicking a new paragraph mark and selecting Paste Do-It-Yourself Table. When adding or modifying a column in Do-It-Yourself Tables, your balances can now include custom adjusting journal entries from working papers. Say that you've created a custom adjusting journal entry in working papers. and you set the entry type as Other Adjusting To. When you go to Add or Modify the Table column, select Variables and set the Balance Type to Report Balance. You'll notice the Other Adjusting To type is available from the list. With these options, reporting is no longer limited to full or modified accrual balances. You can also apply custom calculations to subtotal rows. When you go to Add or Modify a Table column, select Custom Calculation as the column type. You can specify your formula in the space provided. Make sure to check the box before continuing. Subtotals for this column will be automatically calculated based on your formula. When adding a schedule into the financial statement document, you can now specify where to insert the schedule. From the Insert tab, click Statements, then Schedules, and select the schedule from the list. When prompted, click No so that you can specify where to insert the schedule. In the Statement of Cash Flows worksheet, we now support custom balances. Say that we've created a custom balance in Working Papers with the identifier IB. From the Statement of Cash Flow worksheet, you can now select this option from the Balance Source dropdown. This is ideal for when you need to create interim statements. If required, you can always change your balance source back by selecting Default. For more information about additional enhancements in our latest version, see our What's New Financial 17 page. Thanks for watching.